You guys, hello, welcome back to Sean's first time eating. Pop, 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 pop. Cool. You saw the title, you saw the thumbnail. Today we're eating salmon coleslaw burgers. Now I saw these at Pete's Fresh Market here in Chicago, which top notch grocery store. It's like a little concerning how well placed all the produce is. Like, is it Scientologists? Is it a cult? Why are these people so passionate about produce? Oh wow. See, seafood smell nowadays. I used to be like, oh gross. Oh, gross. Now I smell it and I'm like, fresh. Mmm. Mm. Cup of gin. So these salmon burgers have spinach and feta cheese and they were made in the store. How do they make the salmon like this? Do they ground it? Do they rough chop it? Why does this camera angle need to exist? Questions we don't have the answers to. I don't understand the question, and I won't respond to it. Also for these bad boys today, we got these soft, delicious, ooh, fresh brioche buns. Shiny. And homemade, well, store-made, <laughs> coleslaw. Nice and creamy, tangy, delicious. Look at this, overall, we're just gonna have ourselves a nice little dinner here. Sometimes simplicity is better. Or maybe that's just something people with terrible personalities say. Do I have a terrible personality? So basically you're Dave Matthews. We can use him. Um, should I air fry these? Should I pan fry these? I kinda wanna air fry them. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Jackie Air Fryer. What do you say when your husband leaves the bathroom? Don't forget to spray. <laughs> Why would he do something like that? Oh, they're fragile boys. He's a fragile boy. Look at the quality. Look at the quantity and the quality. Let's do one at a time, because I'm nervous. Be confident. 2022 is the year of confidence. Is that the Chinese calendar? Nope. Ely calendar. Am I gonna be five, nine and a half? <laughs> On a good day. So guys, shoot me straight, how's your day? How's everything going? Talk to me, you doing okay? Something I haven't really talked about a lot is like the food content online for me. Like I'm actually a customer, a consumer, a streamer of it myself. I will fire up certain content creators videos, like longer form ones, where they eat like a whole meal without jump cuts, and I'll eat with them. And I'll just like kind of feel like I'm hanging out with the person, like, do you guys have that? Is there anybody that you like watch and eat with, and you like look forward to it every single day? I'm kind of like intimidated to be one of those people that does like a, you know, a 30 or 40 minute upload with like very little editing. It's just like hanging out and talking and seeing how you guys are doing. You know, talking about my day and what I'm up to. Cause that's tough to do. Uh, that's very, you're very vulnerable in that state. And uh, if you guys would ever be interested in that, let me know. If not, totally fine. You know I'm still that jump cut haven, living, breathing, annoying, dude on your screen. You see me in a lot of different YouTube videos and a lot of different channels, but I'm here for you. I'm also gonna use a toaster for the buns. Go ahead, toast them. Normalize cutting boards as plates. Have we done it yet? It'd be fun though, like get a bunch of food and just kinda, I could either do it live or we could just all like, I could just, you know, upload it as its own thing, but it'd be like a bunch of sushi or like a bunch of Thai food or like something you guys suggest, like what should it be? And I'll just like, we'll all have dinner together. You know, we do it like around dinner time, we just hang out, we eat food, we talk about life. I don't know, man. I think this kind of, content creating world is the future. I feel like I would much rather get to know, watch, and hang out with YouTubers than I would Apple TV+, Plus, Amazon, Netflix. Those are great, trust me. Best spatula in the game. Stay together for the kids. Stop crumbling. Okay, thermometer. Oh yeah. Perfect. Whoa. Honestly crisped up, real nice. Great looking little patty. I don't know what the hell this is. Like I do, but I don't. I'm in the toaster corner. Any guesses to what goes on over here? I mean, that's perfectly cooked. Ow, 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 ow. I think this is one of the world's great sounds. Simple build. Going right on here. Okay. Move our slaw. How are we looking? Give him a little hat. 
I mean, it looks and smells incredible. Okay, here we go. Very excited. Sean's first time eating salmon coleslaw burgers. Are we ready? Cheers. Oh my God. Look at how crumbly and tender that is. That is, wow. We eat a lot of salmon in this house. I've never had salmon cooked better than when Allie does it. But, why we've never been doing salmon burgers? What am I even looking for? This thing is no joke incredible. Look, at, it's like half of this just flaked off. Holy smokes. What am I, a youth pastor that's trying not to curse? Holy smokes! Get in the bus, Colin. Look at the toast. Mmm, that's addicting. Will it work with my favorite hot sauce on planet Earth? Double take scotch bottom mustard. Oopsies. <laughs> that's probably too much, but you know, YOLO. <laughs> it works, but it's hot. I'm adding this to the weekly repertoire. This salmon burger is a lot like a kid that graduates out of college with a communications degree. He or she can wear many hats, they can do a lot of things. Salmon. But nobody respects them. Guys, straight up. I'm not even embellishing this for the video, like how much more the content pops if I'm like, mm, oh, mm. This is straight up insane. If you ever near a Pete's Fresh Market, or you wanna try spinach feta salmon burgers, what the hell? The consistency is just out of this world. <laughs> I gotta stop doing it. I need a new bottle of that. I need a new bottle of that. Last bite. I forgot about the crumbs. Many last bites. 100% absolutely sign me up. If you guys had salmon burgers, am I ridiculous for waiting this long to buy this for my home? Cook it, maybe the air fryer also really ramped it up. Cooked it to exactly 135, took it out. He took it out. It cooks a little bit longer, like up to like 140-ish. Perfection camera angle that doesn't need to exist. Go home. Wow. I learned a lot today about food and about myself, how to mentally approach situations better. Wow. Guys, I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video, a brand new vlog on this channel. Thank you so much for watching, and thanks for being here for this monumental moment. You know, people are gonna talk about 10, 20 years in the future, where were you when Sean Ely had his first salmon burger with feta and spinach and put coleslaw on it? You're gonna be like, you know what? Sitting in my living room, or at my desk, or on the toilet. Probably on the toilet, but you remember that. Cheers to us. Welcome to my eating channel. I'm Sean, and I like trying food for the first time in front of an audience. It's very orange. Okay, good bun uh, texture. Good texture. It has like the same texture as like my mom's shredded chicken sandwiches. I mean, it's good. You cooked it perfectly. Definitely would eat again. It was really good outside of it. Not a big bun person. Unless it's your butt.